，你是觉得是你，你打，好啊，打三个星期，打几个，呃，等于几个星期，等于把三个月了，可以的，呀，呃，等于那打打没那里边，那就蛮痛，已经痛死了，你，一，已经痛不干净。啊，好的，也没这种好的，一接一接接个通个药来的，一接个通了，我说他他，啊，我说他妈先接接过来的，你那能看不看药来？我说先接来的，先接个一接接个完了，一接都接完了，搞的卡卡嗦嗦的，嗦嗦嗦的，罗罗嗦嗦嗦的，嗯，别人来打女佣吧，另外打女的，嗯，卡卡嗦嗦的，别人接的。这一些这个嘛的，对了，可能也没这个搞的，三五个一线的，确当了那个变了，确定了呢，确的，确一些个没的，不是，全部那个确的确当了，当讲的，对嘛有那个确当嘛的，对了，一些的，得几个毛子，对了，几那嘛那种真的。我就看了中国药的，看了中国药的，呀，看见上中国人中国药的，做官中国药的，真，吃上中国人，那还蛮够吃中国的。我是一级的西服，一级、二级，工作上不不那么，一，看的，你看嘞，一级的男人这边的，一级的现在出个破啊，家里药的，一级的嘛，现在，给不了刚刚三级申请这块药嘛，一级的是吧？哦，十五个内容，十大几单嘛，真的。三五分钟弄得干净，通了，这一切就解决好过了。这么老的，那是蛮痛，一心痛死了。一心就我我这咋看呢？这个多坚强些，多坚强，干个的，三五分钟弄的，才几万米吧，跑七万米吧，坚强跑着吃了。嗯，多几去，多弄点巴松，有点毛病就要了的。哦。第一道路就去点了，点么？三点路的，你连路上去了，对啦。你这里接下来要下过呢，肯定就定是我开。现在他三万八多分就八十一次。哦，就给你，我讲今日他们没那么难就来一次。嗯，第一道路就去了，第二道多不干啥？去第二道马多不干啥啊？等于老百姓吃饱的，吃上吃龙大白。去那茶楼子里面，这个这娃节目，当你身为一的娃娃呢，没管没变，很简单，东东你嘛，是呢，东我们内陆的东你都很简单的就管了，对，嗯，上街生意人的娃，生意人，上街生意人频道，对你用不着的，这东西呢，对你一年的还好用着的，嗯，好说。啊，三级升级，你知道吧？三，哦，这，这，这咋办？是通过药了吧？上周那里，这，这看见上周那里蛮多了，这多把钱是吧？哦，这多把钱，老了，老了都十几，他们去，女模块都把那上周那吃上去吃上了吧？别弄吃几块了吧？上周那吃些的，我就看了多，吃吃一斤几块了吧？几？早嘛早早管你，第七班还好上嘛，嗯 ，OK， 哦，第七呢上几层比你七八岁，比你上面那点呢，等中了一点，还好上，大一就还好上了，第二好了，哦，确实是确实把就管了一起。So what is the relation between the one who is performing and the Toa, the spiritual master, and then the one for whom it is performed for a sentient being? As Milarepa has said, I do not see samsaric consciousness, but I see wisdom. When one sees wisdom, primordial awareness, one realizes the view which is the inseparable union of samsara and nirvana. One sees that samsara and nirvana have a single ground. 
the single ground is um, the mind which has a single ground. So when we say all our minds have a single ground, for example, mm -hmm. all the beings in this building, their minds is one, then no one will have trust in that because it seems that we appear separately in different forms. Within the six realms of samsara, beings appear in various forms. They experience various experiences of happiness and suffering due to their afflictive emotions and various karmas. So when we say that there is only a single ground, it is um, difficult to believe that. So what does it mean when one says samsara and nirvana is an inseparable union? This single ground of the mind is like clear water. This clear water is like is the primordial awareness, the Buddha nature. And then depending on various conditions or circumstances that one encounters that may be obscured. For example, this clear water may be used to prepare um, food if it meets these conditions, but also it may flush down a toilet if it meets that condition. So depending on the various conditions that one encounters, the difference between Buddhas and sentient beings comes about. In the Samantabhadra prayer it is said, there is a single ground, yet two paths and two fruitions. So in the power practice we understand this single ground, the connection, the relation between the sentient being and the Buddhas who perform poem, who have realized the nature of mind. When one examines the nature of mind and realizes its nature, one sees that there is a single essence, a single ground. And therefore, but the Milarepa had said, I do not see samsari consciousness, I see wisdom, primordial awareness. And that wisdom is the Dharmakaya, the Buddha Vajradhara. This actual nature of mind transcends both birth and cessation. It is unchanging and possesses the seven qualities of the Vajra. It is invincible. So when one realizes the nature of mind to transcend birth and cessation, then one realizes the meaning of what Lord Chipton Sungan had said, this lifetime, the next lifetime and the pardo are one. Then one realizes this lifetime is actually just like a dream. So a person who has not realized that has just become their mind has just become temporarily like an ice block. And when they then relate to those who have cultivated great compassion, their minds um, establish a connection. And so that person who has given rise to great compassion, unconditioned compassion, realizes the nature of mind, which is emptiness, and so realizes the union of emptiness and compassion. That marks the difference between the Buddhas and sentient beings, and yet the ground of their mind is a single one, and in this way they are relating to each other. Just depending on various circumstances that one encounters, the difference between Buddhas and sentient beings comes about. But at all times, the nature of their mind, the ground of the mind, remains to be a single one.那么我们讲到破瓦见到能够证到就说轮回涅槃无二无别不可分离的话我们就可以证到新的本质也就是一地